You and your team are trying to decide on what issues to tackle next. Let's walk through the ideas list and see how you can develop a product process that's easy to understand. Your ideas list contains your entire product backlog. It is divided into three sections, unsorted, backlog, and archived. Your unsorted list contains all new items added. This is a great place for you to validate ideas before you approve them into the backlog. To clearly highlight what your approval process looks like, we generally recommend having a set of workflow statuses available that show the different steps ideas will go through as they move along. Your backlog list contains all items that have been reviewed for work or are in the process of being worked on. Within this tab, you have three views you can work with. The list view is a flexible list of items. You can use the list settings to adjust the columns and create your own custom view. As with the unsorted list, make sure you have a set of workflow statuses available here to indicate the process ideas are going through. The chart view gives you an overview of all ideas that have been scored for impact and effort, plotted in a priority chart that indicates your quick wins and time sinks. The size of the dot indicate how well specced out ideas are. The bigger the dots, the more information these ideas have. The color of the dot lets you know when the idea was last updated. All dots start out as hot pink, and as time goes by, they will eventually fade out to gray if they are not updated. The third view available is the workflow view. This is where you will map out your ideation process and share progress with your team. Ideas synced with any third-party apps will be marked with the integration name in color, giving you a quick visual indication of any active syncs. To help you manage larger volumes of data, you can use the filters available to focus on specific items. You can filter based on products, tags, and even workflows. This can easily help you keep track of trends as they're growing, making it easy to keep on top of your backlog. Once your ideas have completed their own set of workflows, you can move them to the archived list so they are moved from the main active lists and help you keep things tidy. All of this combined allows you to make an accurate decision about what to tackle next. Take the quiz to test your knowledge or move on to the next video in the playlist.